not really sure how to describe this. So, uh, we're going to say two generations. of marriage and that's kind of a I guess a misnomer because not everybody um, in my family has married even into their 60s some and that's like not even in a um that's not in a they have a significant other it's they've chosen the legit single path um and so we're gonna do single and married and divorced. I have been told in my family's kind of small just to the um, so we're gonna do two generations two generations it's gonna be parents generation and grandparents and for my parents it's gonna include blood aunt aunt and uncle. Um, I have zero first cousins and only one blood aunt and one blood uncle. Okay, so let's face down. So my blood aunt. aunt is single she's the legit kind of single where she's in her 60s and single and has not married my so there's one so the count for this column is one married is my parents are married and my dad's Parents were married until my uncle, not my uncle, my granddad passed away, my grandpa passed away, and my grandma has not remarried, she has not dated anyone, she's coming on 15 years a widow. Um, yeah, loyalty. Though, just because someone gets a divorce doesn't mean they're disloyal. To be fair, though I grew up with this, because before I was born, my mom's parents were divorced. Uh, the male, so my granddad, he remarried. My grandma did not. And then my blood uncle, he, in my lifetime, I, think, I was super young though, if I'm recalling correctly. So I don't, I don't really remember. It might've been before me, but like there was... A first wife, a divorce, then I remember the lady next, the girlfriend, and then there's the current wife, so the second wife. So, not, whew, that's not three, it's two, what the heck. It's counting this way, not this way, two. So, some people like percentages, so there's five, do a little, five pairings, or pairings, uh, entities here. So one is going to be 20% of the two generations above me in my family, because I have only one blood aunt, one blood, one blood aunt, one blood uncle, and zero first cousins. I have, um, so 20% are single, and I've been single throughout my lifetime. 40% have remained married, and 40% have been or gotten div divorced. So that's the breakdown for me and my parents' generation and my grandparents. Uh, yeah, some people have their parents get divorced, but then everybody else in their family is still married. Uh, I had a, a bit of a different experience. And so multiple relationships, multiple meaning two or more, um, where divorce occurred.